today I'm trying Fortnite performance mode for the first time ever. Ever since I got my new PC, I keep all my settings at medium and I cap my FPS at 165 because it makes my game really clear and smooth when I'm recording. It just makes it look nice. So with my normal settings and my FPS uncapped, this is the frames that I get in my like private island. It's in the like 600s. If I just go ahead and free build a little bit, can't exactly see where it's at, but like 400, 500, I'm thinking. Not to mention, this is also while I have my OBS running and recording. So now let's see what happens when I turn on performance mode. I can definitely, literally just in the lobby, I can tell a huge difference just from the 3D resolution, I'm assuming, right here on the character. The edges and the whole character is so pixelated. Let's see how this looks. Looking up, I'm popping into the 700s now, higher 600 frames just looking up. I literally have never watched anyone play with this, and I've never played with performance mode. This is strange. I feel like I can't really see anything, but at the same time, I'm not messing up any builds. So let's see, because I know that there's different settings that come along with this. So I actually can still change my view distance, my texture, and my 3D resolution. So if I turn my 3D resolution to 100%, I don't really care about texture view distance also doesn't matter so now my game looks a lot better holy maybe it was just my textures now we're popping into the 800 for my frames just looking up when i build i'm seeing like 500 600 and with this the builds still look weird but my actual character in the whole just area doesn't look super pixelated now i've heard that not only does this give you better performance by giving you more frames and less frame drops but it also supposedly decreases decreases your input lag. So far, I have honestly not been able to tell it feels the exact same. As far as controller responsiveness goes and that sort of stuff, it literally feels the exact same. I can't tell a difference. But I've never actually experienced any issues with input lag. It's always felt really good. So even though I don't feel a decrease in input lag, my game still does feel really good. Like it just feels super smooth, especially even while I'm recording to get like 700 frames while I'm sitting here free building and no frame drops nothing it just feels really good now i know they changed the builds to look like mobile builds for a little bit and i thought that looked really ugly but then they changed it back or gave people the option to go to these builds i'm not exactly sure how to switch between those options i wouldn't want the builds that look like mobile anyway i don't think they look good however i can sit in my private creative island and stare into the sky and get 850 fps all i want but your frames really don't matter until you're in an actual game so let's go do that all right let's go ahead and drop pleasant we had a huge dip when we jumped out but we're still keeping even like going down when all this is in frame we're keeping like over 300 frames that is nuts the game doesn't even look bad right now and i'm literally getting like 300 plus up here now i only have a 144 hertz monitor i don't even have a 240 so really getting 400 fps makes no difference like i could be getting 200 fps and i'd be fine but we're gonna do it to them because we can That guy missed every shot. Nice. Okay, everything looks very bright. I'm not exactly sure why. I don't know if it changed that setting, but everything looks very like overexposed right now. Like it's a little bit hard to see. Especially when you're placing builds like that. I don't know. I just find it like hard to see. Ooh. 
messed my edit up, thought I could place the stair, but we're on like 60 ping in arena, it's whatever. Not gonna lie, I didn't think that I liked performance mode, but in reality, it's actually not that bad. Like, I kind of like it. As far as the brightness stuff goes, I'm on 100%. I don't know if I should turn that down or not. You guys gotta let me know down in the comments. I don't know the best settings. I don't know if there's a colorblind setting that you're supposed to be on if you're using performance mode. I'm not too familiar with this, so let me know. But I've never really been too concerned about performance because I don't play comp. If you look at my ping right now, I'm on like 71 ping. It just doesn't work. I can't play comp. I mean, when you're facing really good players in tournaments and stuff, especially when they're on lower ping, it's literally impossible to hold your wall or do anything. You're at a massive disadvantage, so I just choose not to play comp. I mean, literally the last time that I played any sort of competitive was like Season X. I took trios kind of seriously back then. And that was back when I had my old PC, my $450 PC. I wish performance mode was around back then. I had my own sort of performance mode. I just kept everything as low as it could possibly be, which is kind of another reason why I like to keep my settings a little bit higher on this PC. PC because I have a 3070 and i7 10700. I finally have a nice PC build, so I don't want to be stuck back on those same settings that I had back when I had my $450 PC. However, I feel like the game still looks pretty good right now. Like, it doesn't look bad at all. Now, what's bad is my aim. Yeah, it doesn't feel too bad, especially for being on like 60 ping. I've been able to get people's walls and stuff. I don't know, maybe the info lag thing is true. Another issue I've seen with performance mode is zone, but the zone actually doesn't look too bad right now. I think it's mainly when it's bright outside. Like when the map is bright, that's when the zone gets pretty hard to see. I don't have too many maps to fight this. Mm, I'm on a match. Yeah, this is a bit hard to see and Yeah, I think I'm dead. Here. Oh, no way. He was at one HP as well. Well, I think I can conclude that performance mode is good. I mean, people have probably known that since it came out like two months ago. But I've never tried it and I actually enjoyed it. I might keep using it. Not completely sure yet. But it definitely made my game feel way better. Especially because it wasn't like just in creative. It was actually in arena, in the real map. And I was getting way less frame drops. It felt a lot better. The only thing that was kind of weird was fighting in zone there. And then how bright it got. Maybe there's fixes for those but overall i enjoyed it thank you guys for watching hope to see you in another one